Every child's genetic inheritance is precious, but what we inherit from our parents is far from fixed because what we experience in our lives, from the food we eat to the trauma we endure, can leave a lasting genetic imprint. But what if the effects of the schoolyard bully were imprinted on the very genes of a victim? This would mean that everything we'd been taught about biology was wrong. It would mean our genetic legacy wasn't fixed at birth, but instead is flexible and fluid. Seemingly inconsequential events, like the food you ate for lunch or the stress of your morning commute, can change who you are and even the genes you'll pass on. Findings in the field of epigenetics have changed everything about something we all thought we knew. Imagine we are not only the culmination of our genes, but the life experiences of our parents and ancestors. In a single generation, the way our genes behave can completely change, promoting greater health and well-being or causing disease. I'm New York Times best-selling author and physician, Dr. Sharon Moalam. In my new book, Inheritance, I explain the new frontier of inheritability because our genes don't easily forget. Inheritance. Understand it.